Sorry, we just had to have a milk and Jaffa cake. <laughs> yeah, I got a little bit thirsty then. Okay, carry on. I'm just going to carry on. But if you like this video, you can subscribe here. Up in the sky. <laughs> well, basically, whatever you want on screen. Because this is a new book and I might be able to finish this whole book today. Off we go then. And there's going to be loads of expressions. <laughs> what said there, curiously, is an avalanche. You can sit up. An avalanche, said Rabbit, pointing at the snowball that was rolling, is a huge load of snow that falls down a mountain faster than a train. My grandfather was buried in an avalanche, he had to eat his own leg to survive while he was waiting for them to dig him out. Really? said Bear, impressed. He must have been buried for a, for a very long time. Well, no, said Rabbit. About ten minutes. But he was very hungry. We get very, very hungry in our family. Yes, we do. <laughs> Even in our family, we do. Literally, I eat loads. Oh, yes, they do. Definitely. Where's the rabbit? Hmm. There's a lot of them. I can see where a rabbit is. Well, keep reading. I know. So everyone's waiting. Oh, there it is. Bears. Snooch. Snooch. Stomach. There's the rabbit. your face. Bear's stomach rumbled. Oh yes, said Rabbit. I'd forgotten you haven't any food. How did you know, said Bear? Okay, sit up. I'm sitting up. Sit up. But Rabbit was gone. Soon he had re reap reappeared. Reappeared. Yeah. No hard feelings, said Rabbit. Here. And he handed Bear the oldest, saddest, floppiest, blackest carrot Bear had ever seen. You can eat it or use. It has a nose for your snowman. Bear sniffed the black floppy carrot. Ugh. Ear. Nose, I think, said Bear. Would you like to help me build my snowman? Rabbit thought. And second. No, he said. Bear side turned and rolled her snowball back down Rabbit's hill. By the time she, she'd got it back up her own hill, it was bigger than the first one. Perfect, thought Bear, panting. She started to make a head. Pretty soon she was humming, singing. Thing, whatever, I don't mind. Rabbit could hear Bear's song from his burrow. Hmm, said Rabbit. Making a snowman does seem to be Rabbit to have trouble saying the next word because he never used it before. Fa, 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 fa. 
fun. Ha! I shall make an even better snowman. But first, for energy, rub it a lot. And lots of honey and frozen salmon and delicious beetles eggs that you'd stolen from there during the storm. Mm -hmm. Full of memories. It'll be beetles eggs. Oh, with a beetle inside. Ew! This is carrot. Let's go and see it again. There he is, stuffing his face with bad food. Like, he's not actually stuffing it, he's only got four in his hand. So look at it somewhere. Then he did a little poo and ate it. That rather embarrassing habit was the reason R Rabbit never invited people over for tea. I've forgotten to say thanks for the carrot, said Bear's voice right behind Rabbit. Ah! Rabbit jumped his own height in right and scrambled out of the burrow. Oh, there, you're welcome. I say, did you just eat your own poo? Said Bear, wondering if She'd seem right. Uh, the rabbit. Yes, a little bit. A little bit. A little bit of your own poo. Asked Bear, wondering if she'd heard right. Shush, said the rabbit, glancing around. Look. All rabbits do it. It's perfectly normal for a rabbit, maybe. Said bear. Said bear. Said bear. <laughs> said bear. Said bear. Said bear. <laughs> Well, said Rabbit, drawing himself up to his full height, which gave him a good a good view of Bear's tummy. I'm sure Bears do something in the woods that they wouldn't like to talk about. But why do rabbits eat their poo? said Bear. Well, why do you eat? said Rabbit. Um, to get energy and make new bits of Bear. Makes the poo. Bear. Poo Bear. <laughs> poo Bear. Exactly. 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 Exactly, said Rabbit. It's easy to make a bear out of honey, salmon and delicious beetles eggs. That full of energy. It's easy to make a wolf out of meat full of energy. But it's really, really difficult to make a cat to make a rabbit out of plants. Why? said Bear. Oh. I like it when I do that. Because
because when you eaten the plants and digested them in your tummy for hours the poo the pooed them and pooed them the job is only half done no energy said bear none said rabbit the energy is still trapped in the poo it's soft of soft and like black licorice yes yes said bear hesitatingly <laughs> i think it's good so you have to eat your own poo said a bit and digest it all over again to get energy out i think that's how we got so far <laughs> Really, said Bear. For some reason, she wasn't hungry anymore. Yes, said Rabbit. And then you have to poo a totally different kind of poo. Sort of a dry brown poo with just, with just the grassy twiggy bits in. Oh, I think I have to start again. Mm -hmm. I did it all wrong. I'm just going to start the page over again. Mm -hmm. Really, said Bear? From the reason she wasn't hungry anymore. Yes, said Robert. And then you have to poo a totally different kind of poo. Sort of a dry poo with the grassy pooky bits in. Bear felt quite weak. So, um, uh, do you, Rabbit, eat the other kind of poo? She said. What? said Rabbit. He couldn't quite believe his enormous ears. The dry brown ones with the grassy twiggy bits in. Bear added, hopefully. This is the bit. Eat the other kind of poo, said Rabbit. Eat the other kind of poo? That's disgusting. Oh good, said Bear. Just joking.